In the world of neurological research, breakthroughs shape the future of brain health. This video summarizes a recent brain photobiomodulation clinical trial by a researcher at the University of California, San Francisco on dementia. Brain photobiomodulation involves the delivery of high-powered near-infrared light energy through the skull to stimulate the brain. This process heals damaged brain cells, improves cerebral blood circulation, reduces inflammation and toxicity, and regenerates damaged brain cells. In 2015, a pilot trial by V-Light, co-authored by Harvard Medical School and Boston University School of Medicine, was the first in the world to demonstrate results with photobiomodulation within a pilot trial for Alzheimer's using the V-Light Neuro, a home-use device. Fast forward to 2019, Dr. Linda Chow, a professor of psychiatry and biomedical imaging at the University of California, embarked on her own independent study with the V-Lite NeuroGamma to verify the 2015 pilot trial's findings. Dr. Chow's study involved eight participants, diagnosed with dementia, divided into two groups, one receiving usual care and the other undergoing home photobiomodulation sessions with the V-Lite NeuroGamma. The V-Lite NeuroGamma utilizes a specific set of parameters. It emits high-powered near-infrared light at a wavelength of 810 nanometers and a frequency of 40 hertz. The neuro emits the highest power density for a brain photobiomodulation device, capable of delivering more than 100 milliwatts per centimeter squared, in a patented design targeting selected regions of the brain for exceptional outcomes. To measure the effectiveness of this stimulation, various assessments were employed. These included the Alzheimer's Disease Assessment Scale, Cognitive Subscale, and the Neuropsychiatric Inventory. Additionally, MRI scans were taken to delve deeper into the changes occurring within the brain. The results were encouraging. After 12 weeks, the photobiomodulation group showed significant improvements in cognitive function and reduced dementia-related behaviors, as indicated by lower ADAS COG and NPI scores. Cerebral perfusion, or blood flow within the brain, increased, particularly in the parietal regions of the brain, where the light stimulation was concentrated. The most thrilling discovery was the improvements in brain connectivity within the default mode network, a vital system for brain health. These might account for the improved cognition scores in this trial. This study not only validated the groundbreaking 2015 pilot trial, but also paved the way for V-Light to engage in more rigorous clinical trials to validate the product efficacy, such as a 228 participant pivotal clinical trial. With no adverse effects reported, brain photobiomodulation may be a promising avenue to enhance the quality of life for those facing dementia. As science continues to unravel the mysteries of the brain, the future holds promise for innovative solutions that could change lives. The journey of brain photobiomodulation reminds us that with each discovery, we get a step closer to making history in the field of brain research. And so, the story of brain photobiomodulation continues, lighting up the path towards a brighter future for dementia.